toughest scene uh, that I've ever filmed hasn't aired yet. The toughest scene that I filmed that has aired yet was uh, when Juice tried to take his own life. That was, uh, when you gotta get in that mindset, it's, it's crazy. It's a weird, it's a weird kind of place to go to in your head. The hardest death to watch up until last year, I thought, was uh, was Opie. It still kind of gets me, but man, being a part of the whole Tara death, see, you know, being there and, and being there the two nights that we filmed it with Gemma and the whole thing with the fork and the sink, and that was rough. It was rough because Tara was like the you know the queen of the show in a way, so it was kind of a hard one to watch, mainly because I was so intimately involved with it. Uh, I think that it was inevitable. You know, with the way it's built up over the six years, and I think that the final season is the, the final act, the way it plays out with, you know, the, the positions these people have put themselves in in their life. So I think the darkness is just a result of, of the storytelling, of what's been happening. I mean, you can look at it as dark, you can look at it as retribution, you can look at it as just inevitably the way it was going to go. Um, so, I, I, you know, Kurt could write anything. He could write a song and dance episode, he could write anything, and to me it's exactly the way it's supposed to be, because it's his vision, and I think his vision has gotten us to this, which is just incredible. Without a doubt, uh, the, the, the stuff with me and Tig uh, feeding the crank to the Doberman way back in season one, it's kind of when I knew we, we it's established his and I relationship, you know, on and off camera, and, uh, and just, you know, how you know we're best friends in like every way and brothers, but also I just thought that scene was absolutely hysterical and kind of defined both of us. And that whole episode we spent together, you know, me feeding that crank to the dogs, the dog biting him, and then him telling me, because uh, I say, oh, we should get close, we should bond, and he's like, I'll dump my balls in your mouth. It was just a funny, it was back when it was light and comedic, and I've been in such a chaotic tailspin of darkness that sometimes you think about those with fond memories. So that, that was a, that was pretty interesting stuff. Special thanks to Robert Wayne Footwear and Doc Martin.